In this video, you will learn that how to interface sound sensor with Arduino. So let's make the circuit. First of all, pick the components from here and uh, pick the Arduino Uno. Double click on it. Now pick the LCD and I'm choosing the 20 cross 4 LCD. This means that it uh, having 20 characters and 4 lines. So every line will have four, four, 20 characters. Now choose the LED. I'm choosing the yellow LED. Double click on it. Now choose the logic state. Double click on it. And now choose the sound sensor. So here you can see the sound sensors. And if you don't have the sound sensor in your Proteus, you can add it. The libraries are available in the link provided in the description you can download from there and if you don't know how to add the sound sensor to the Proteus so you can watch my video link is also available in the description and there you can learn that how to add a sound sensor to the Proteus so double click on it and now click on ok now place the Arduino here now choose the LCD and make the connection as I am doing. Now place the LED. Connect it with pin 7. And now connect the sensor place it here and now connect the power and the ground where required so ground the sensor as well ground the LCD sorry Arduino now LCD and now connect it with the LED now connect power with sensor connect it with Arduino as well and the LCD as well now connect the out pin of the sensor with the Arduino pin digital pin 2 now it's almost ready let me zoom it to a specific area Save it and uh, so now it's time to uh, upload the code. So code uh, you can see here uh, comments are already written with almost every line. So let me run it and uh, after compilation uh, copy the hex file from here. click select it and then click and press ctrl c paste the code in the arduino click on ok now add the hex file to the sound sensor as well and uh, that can be found in the library of a sound sensor and you can download the libraries from the link provided in the description click on it uh, edit properties then search from here and go to the sound sensor library folder open it and then select the hex file open it and then click on ok now we have to connect the logic state with this as well rotate it like this connect it with the test pin of a sensor Uh, zoom it to a specific area now your circuit is ready and let's run it 
so here you can see the bright light my channel name sound sensing system the project name and here you can see the state of the sensor so no sound means that uh, now it didn't detect any sound so after detecting the sound so it will show here the uh, relevant information i'll say d then you can see here the led is also turned off and when it detect the sound so this will uh, glow up also it will show an lcd that uh, sound detected so here you can see the logic state uh, and it, uh, it is zero so zero means that no sound whenever it goes to one so it means that it detected the sound and then we will check the reaction on lcd and the led as well so let me make it one here you can see the no sound and lcd is also turned off so let me make it one here you can see that sound detected you can see here an lcd it's saying that sound detected also the LCD led is uh, turned on so when when i uh, make it zero so you can see here no sound also the led is uh, turned off and when when it detect the sound so the led will glow up also it will say sound detected on lcd as well so you can you can uh, show here uh, uh, any other information that you want to, to display an lcd as well also you can uh, connect any relay and any kind of uh, uh, alarm or anything else that you want to so let me make it uh, zero so it will then uh, say that no sound also it will turn off uh, let me check it again sound detected and uh, here you can see the led is uh, turned on so in this way you can interface the sound sensor with the arduino the circuit diagram and code link is available in the description you can download from there if you like the project please subscribe my channel also like and share the video visit my channel for more videos related to arduino thanks for watching